A formal invitation to this effect took place last week when the Eastern Britain community, led by Governor Nakikus Konga and Provincial Administrator Wilson Matawa, visited Sir Michael's house cry in Port Moresby. The invitation was done through the laying of traditional Tonai Shell Money Tabu by the four Eastern Britain MPs, senior statesman and former MP Sir Sinai Brown to begin the process. Initial preparations have started with the approval of 100,000 kina by the Provincial Executive Council this week. A further 150,000 kina was approved for the Eastern Britain House Cry over the past two weeks. The announcement was made by Governor Konga when paying his tribute at the Kokopo Show Ground House Cry. Konga said a 100,000 kina will be parked for next year's Kutu Tabu ceremony. A date is yet to be set by the late Sir Michael's adopted Malamale clan of Wunabalbal, including people from his birthplace Rapidik Matapit in Rabal district. The Malamale clan have also been recognized and acknowledged for initiating Grand Chief and giving him the name Topalangat. The ceremony is tentatively said to coincide with his first death anniversary. Terry Longwood, TV One News.